step up. My name is Aisha, and I'm from. I'm a youth organizer with SOS. Mm -hmm. And my question is, um, why does society turn away from the youth, but then shame them when they they do something that land them in prison? So to be clear, why does society turn their back on the youth, but then shame them when they do get caught up in the criminal justice system? Thank you. And I think it's because society stops seeing our young people as young people. And that's, that's, a, that's a real problem. I mean, you know, the reality for me, right? Every day I wear a suit. If I see a police officer, he don't think twice about me. He says hi and keeps walking. On the weekends, I like to wear sweatpants and a baseball cap. When I wear my sweatpants and a baseball cap, I go into a store, they follow me. The police see me, they slow down. That's the reality, right? When the color of our skin and who we are and where we come from, people see that and assign certain characteristics about who we are. And unfortunately, the way society is seeing our young people, they're seeing our young people as predators and not young people to be valued and to be supported. Sophia, you said hypocrisy. I, yes, it is hypocrisy. Mm -hmm. Because Absolutely. there's nobody in here that hasn't been a teenager. That's right. That's right. <laughs> who hasn't done dumb stuff. That's right. Absolutely. But we've decided now we're going to criminalize all that same dumb stuff that everybody used to do before. And that's right. hypocritical. Yep. And we have to be honest enough as adults to expose that and not keep perpetrating this fraud of young people like you all are doing something that we didn't do. Because you're not. Mm-hmm.